Drive, the ultimate crashing simulator. This is still a car game, and for some reason, people gave me a cannon. Ooh, I gave the car a haircut. Over the past little while, I've absolutely fallen in love with BeamNG. Thank you so much to all of you guys who have submitted some mods on the AR12 Discord server for me to check out. I've downloaded a bunch of them and I wanted to check them out today. Let's start things up with a little bit of Cops and Robbers. Is it really BeamNG if you don't play Cops and Robbers? Chase the gang members and arrest them all one by one. It's a major challenge, but you're the best officer to to get the job done. So how many people do I need to arrest? There are three of them. I don't know if there's a certain amount of damage I need to get them to, or if I need to like, I'm gonna need to slow them down properly. Okay, there we go. That's gonna be number one. He is in fact a spoon. Where have the other suspects gone? I have absolutely no idea. Look at the distance, it's zooming. Oh my God, they're gone. Uh-oh. You're Nick. I mean, you're dead, but you are also Nick. I'm the worst police officer in the world. To be fair, no police officer in the history of police officers has ever single-handedly had to arrest three people like this. Shit! That worked really well right up until it didn't. All the AI literally just drives around randomly, so I can't even do it, like, systematically. So I'm just gonna arrest them one by one. Simple, easy claps. You ready? Never mind. Got him. Oh my god! No way! No way! I turn the corner, and these two guys yeet their own car. Stop. 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 Stop resisting. Yes! Are you kidding me? I'm literally chasing some three-wheeled plebe, a cinquecento, and something all the way up there. Goddamn European cop sirens. Okay, smash into the three-wheeler. He's gone. Okay, now I've got to get the cinquecento and the guy in front of him. This thing's way nicer to drive than the Dodge Charger from before. Okay, spin him. Got him. Got him. Got him. You're nicked, sunshine. This front guy is rapid. I don't want to let him run away. Get him. Ah! Oh my god. I'm not I'm not following him through there. Break, 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 break. I mean, that's certainly one way to get rid of the cop. Yes, look at the little feet. Little feet's having a big problem. Stop. 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 Got him. Got him. Got him. I know if I follow this reliant for long enough, he will just flip over. Maybe he just needs a little bit of encouragement. There he goes. Stop. Got him. 500 meters away. 400 meters away. Oh my god. Oh my. I think we're on the same road. I think he's up here. He is. Stop. You bitch. I am now officially part of the Stance Nation crew. Gentle pit maneuver. That was very gentle. Box him in now. Yes. Yes. I think I got him stuck. Easy clap. So look up at the canopy with your tires washing off the fresh water. Isn't it beautiful? The looks are deceiving though, is this trail is not so easy. Blah, 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 blah. Get to the finish line. So this is my vehicle and I've got to go... I, I guess I just go through all of the checkpoints. So I can see what they mean. There's little boundaries on the left and the right hand side. I'm gonna need to take this very, very slowly. This is so sick. What a beautiful looking map. Like, if you can mount the little rocks slowly, then you can kind of just crawl them, bounce over the top of them nicely. That's what I'm trying to do. Oh, that's tight. Oh, that's really tight right there. Gotta go low range. Low range. Low range work. I probably should be in low range for all of this. Oh my god, look at this. Come on, not too far back. Yes. No! Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We are fine. Okay, am I really gonna need to balance it? Like this? That is so intense. I th I didn't think it'd be that hard. I don't think this has gone particularly well. Lol, take back. I made it. I lived, I lived, I lived. I have no idea how this thing still works. They literally put the hardest obstacle on checkpoint four. Checkpoint five, not even a challenge. I'm just gonna take the simple path so I don't destroy more of my truck. And then we're going up here. Okay. I didn't see that. You can see my steering rack. I love how I'm able to get it out of the super deep hills. 
And then I'm on literally an off-road dirt path and I hit an rock and that's what kills me. We should be good. We should be good. We should be good. We're good. We're good. Easy clap. I literally love rock crawling. Oh my God. Look at this. How's my approach angle? Good. The pirate triangle, not so good. I can kind of use speed to get over that. Same over here. Just use my speed. Oh, is this it? This is it. Finish line. Let's go! You might remember in the last video of BeamNG I made, I did these garage to garage delivery. Long story short, this guy made garage to garage survival. When I say they're a lot harder, I mean they're basically unwinnable. There will be moderate traffic today. Keep in mind, you cannot reset your vehicle. Damage to the vehicle does not count towards your score. What's important is that you arrive at your destination. We're just gonna follow our racing. Oh my god. We're just gonna follow our racing line. We should arrive there. No! Problem at all. It's like being back in need for speed with the AI being such terrible driver. Like the game said, the amount of damage I get doesn't matter. I just need to get there. Oh my God. The AI are lunatic. This is totally what the average person living at one of the locations of the Horizon Festival would be like. Just absolute kamikaze drivers and I'm just trying to get to my office job and I've got to dodge them. And then you run into Nathan. All right, what? No! No! Wait, you freed me. You legend. Oh my God. I was literally stuck. That is a me. Oh my God. Look at the bus. Bus, 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 bus. Okay. Sorry, 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 sorry. This is really going to be difficult to deliver now. I'm literally just trying to survive the Horizon Festival. Wait, is my steering go- I literally only have one wheel to steer and one wheel to go. At least it's still very good at doing donuts. I'm going to have to abandon this delivery. I didn't make it. This time, I'll be delivering this thing. Lovely. So what's the deal with this one? Again, I'm just going to follow the racing line and go from there. Look at my drift, mom. That was a sick one. Wow. No, no. No! Okay, so I think if you see literally anybody driving at you, just chuck your car in the ditch. It's the safest plan. The highway should actually be pretty safe because at least that way, everybody's going to be going the same direction as me. Sorry. Sorry. Ah! I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. One mile to the destination. I'm going to do it. Maybe. My tire has popped in the rear. I think you got a flat. I... I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Once again, just living that weight reduction life. I'm gonna make it. I can see the parking space. Nothing will go wrong now. Yes! Level two. Welcome to level two difficulty. I did say these challenges were a little bit spicier. I, th I think you can now see why. Also, it looks like the time of day is also sped up for, uh, for, for this mission. Don't worry, the sun will come up in about two seconds. It's stuck. No, I'm not. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, I'm doing a different scenario, one that I can actually do. This is Trailer Rivals. Deliver the furniture to the destination before your opponent does. You can get bonus points if you arrive there quickly, make your rival fall behind, or get your rival to lose their load. I've always been good at that. All right, my destination is in the middle of downtown. That doesn't seem very difficult. All right, well, that guy's gonna do a massive donut and... Oh. Okay, so don't lose my couch cushion. If I can do, like, a big drastic move in front of that other guy, maybe I can make him lose his couch. <gasps> um... We'll try again. Now we've got a completely different destination. Okay, so I assume I've just got to go... Actually, maybe left. Nope, straight, straight, straight. Okay, I'm gonna make this guy lose his cargo. I need to wedge my car in there. My couch! Bye! See, and that's why you shouldn't lose your load too fast. My cushion is trying to... Shit! Your cargo got yeeted! I will try to not yeet my cargo. I do need to get this guy's load out of him, though. I, st I got him! I got him! Man! 
man, I am so good at sending other people's loads far and wide. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I did exactly what I needed to. Oh, shit, shit, shit. And on that bombshell, it's time to end before I make any more sus comments.